So you might be wanting to go ahead and create your personal voice on iOS 17. Now, doing this is actually fairly basic and it really doesn't take too much time, but there is a certain number of iPhone that you need in order to actually do this. And I think it might be an iPhone 12 or above. So keep that in mind. If your iPhone is like an iPhone 11 or iPhone 10, so right or 10s, it's not working right now. But to get started, what you wanna do, once you're on iOS 17, the official version, you wanna go and make your way over to your settings application. And you want to go ahead and scroll down until you see accessibility. So go and click on your accessibility option right there. And then what you're going to want to do here is you basically want to scroll down until you see this personal voice option. So what you're going to want to do is you want to go and tap on personal voice, which is right here. And then here it tells you basically that little option that says create a personal voice. What you want to do is you want to go ahead and tap on create a personal voice. And that will go ahead and start the process of creating a personal voice for you. Now you can see for me, it looks like you need a passcode in order to set it up. Unfortunately, I did not create a passcode on here, but basically what it's going to entail at that point is it's going to require you to basically, once you have a passcode set up and everything, it's going to require you to give 15 minutes of audio inside of the application. So it's going to ask you to you know, say some phrases. It may even ask you, I think sometimes to maybe to repeat a phrase or something like that. I've heard of some people who already set this up and they say it takes a very long time. It seems longer than it is. So just keep that in mind, but basically you go and click on create a personal voice. You go through that initial setup. And after that, basically you'll be good to go. And then you'll basically be able to use that personal voice in certain areas. Now you can also share across devices here, that personal voice, and you can also allow apps, you know, basically to use it. So if an application wants to use your voice inside of the application, you can go and enable it. Not like, you know, them using it without your consent. You'll basically be able to use it, I think, for other apps that were like accessibility type of applications, if you know what I mean. So that's basically how it's done. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.